You alright lads, so today we're going to be reviewing Silver Inform Darlington Nagby of Portland Timbers in the MLS. 5 foot 8 tall, right footed, got high medium work rate, 4 star weak foot and 3 star skills. Current price range is 10.5 to 200k, that is on Xbox and on Playstation as well. So look at his in-games, he stand out to 93 agility, 89 sprint speed, 85 acceleration, 83 balance and 81 dribbling. We have also included all the upgrades of his non-inform as a comparison as we always do so you can compare between the two. So you can always pause it for a close look at any of these now. So this is a team we'll be using them in, a 4-2-3-1 MLS uh, stroke USA side with Nagby in the middle there at camp. So now to the game place, you can see how he was performing for me. Now, obviously, Nagby, he has had that position swap from the right-hand side into the middle, and he does bring that pace and dribbling into a more central, more creative role. And straight away, he did do a lot of damage with that pace, dribbling, and that 93 agility. He really was tearing through the middle. Defo did not feel like a silver player at all. If you just use Nagby without any ratings or any clue, you definitely would think he is a goal player, he was that good, was superb on the ball and he can use that dribble in to keep the ball away from his markers, did have some nice close control while he searches for a pass and that passing was not bad at all, does have 79 short pass and he didn't do actually a bad job creatively, did grab an assist, did do some decent passing overall in that cam roll. So that dribbling really was opening up a hell of a lot of chances for Nagby. So we were able to test his shooting to the fullest extent. Overall, it was decent. Overall, I was happy. But he does lack a bit in the finishing department. Does only have 63 finishing. So his shots can lack a bit of direction. So you're not actually guaranteed a 100% goal, even in the box. Some shots were straying a bit wide. Some were straight at the keeper. But overall, I was happy with his shooting. And he does have that 82 shot power to help slam the balls home as well that really does help him in the shooting department and he did light it up in the goal scoring department as you see in the clips plenty of goals from Nagby does have his four star weak foot as well so he's decent enough on his left if he's forced onto it you're not going to be having too many troubles does have high medium weight rates as well so it will help him push forward and support his striker up top so let's have a look at Inform Nagby's performance stats. So in five games, he did manage an amazing nine goals. Did only grab one assist. All of his stats are on the left-hand side there. All that goal information is on the right. That bottom right position map does show you where his goals were scored and that assist was created from as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Nagby an amazing 9.7 out of 10. Was a truly quality player, especially for a silver. As we said, Defo didn't feel like a silver. He Defo punched well above his weight. And he was banging in the goals from Cam. Really, really great. I think that 4-2-3-1 is my favourite formation for testing out Cams. You really get a good idea of how good they are. Because it's a really good main central pivotal role in the middle. And you can get forward to get the goals out. As well now he is Liberian in game still so is the perfect player to play behind legend where unfortunately there are not many other Liberian players in the game to make a national team but he's a definite must buy for a silver MLS team and really does fit well in at Cam. for me one of the best silvers I've used so far for the performances he was producing in the games for me so finally, we're just going to leave you with Inform Nagabee's positives and negatives to look at. Now, negative-wise, as we said, finishing could be better and you're limited really to an MLS side with his nation links. But I'm sure I've read now he's actually uh, registered as a US citizen. So really should be changed to United States nationality. But EA yeah, are pretty lazy. I'm sure they won't do that. We'll probably have to wait till next year to get a, a USA national uh, Nagby card. Does make highly recommended player though. If you like to play with Silvers, he is a definite one to go out and try. If you can, was amazing for me in that can roll. And he's not too dear either. I picked him up to 40k. I was well happy with that price. But he is actually rising now. I think last time I checked, uh, about uh, a few hours ago, he was hovering around that 50k mark. So I do suggest if you're looking for one, do just snap on him now while he's uh, still in packs. Because he possibly may rise when he's out of packs. So thanks a lot for watching. Please smash a like if you do enjoy the video. It really does help out a lot. Please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. Loads more to check out. Loads of in-depth reviews coming soon and squad builders. So stay tuned for them. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. I really do appreciate it. Cheers, lads. See you later.